Hey, it's Wolf here. Hey, thank you so much for checking out my channel. So in this video, we're going to look at Tezos XTZ. Um, is it still worth buying in 2022? Okay. And uh, also, we're going to, at the end of this video, we're going to do, going to do a little, uh, for fun, we are going to do a quick price prediction. So stay tuned for that. Anyway, so quickly before we start, I want to show you a huge opportunity that's happening right now. So last year, I turned $500 into over $300,000 with crypto. And I had a tons of like 10 axes. 5x like you can see some of my top picks here from last year and tons of people in the portfolio membership made crazy money so from anything from like 5k to up to half a million dollars okay was uh, made and it's crazy so if you want to see which coins i put my money in in 2022 you can check out the first link in the description okay it'll take you to this page and from here on you just simply put zero here so you type in zero so it's completely free for you right so all you have to do is come here and you get instant access to my secret strategies and how I turned $500 into over $300,000. And also if you want to get access to my portfolio, I will still show you how you can access my portfolio. Okay. So that's something that you don't want to miss out on because the bull, we are right now in the bear market. The biggest money is made in the bear market because when you buy low in the bull, next bull, market, bull run, you can sell high, like literally 100x to even 1000x peaks. <coughs> so this is something that you don't want to miss out on. First thing in the description. Anyway, so let's look at this. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so let's open the website and Twitter here and let's look at the chart also. Anyway, so, so a blockchain designed to evolve. So security focused, upgradable, built to last. So these also guys have <coughs> their own smart contract, uh, smart contract language, which is huge. So chain God is following them. So this is a self upgradable and energy efficient proof of stake blockchain. Uh, proof of stake blockchains are going to be the way in my opinion. So for example, um, I have been studying it a lot. Ethereum is moving from proof of work to proof of stake. I don't know why I'm following Ethereum here. So proof of stake is uh, more scalable, more cent uh, decentralized and more secure than proof of work. Okay. So it's just way better. And the way Ethereum is hand uh, like transitioning from proof of work to their own model of proof of stake, it's absolutely beautiful. I think it's going to be just absolutely the best one. So basically Ethereum is going to be like this data, a string of data, kind of like a billboard where people can stick data to it. And uh, then we are going to use, people are going to use CK rollups to uh, scale the uh, scale the uh, transaction speed. So transactions per second. And um, they're also going to use sharding to scale the layer one. Anyway, so the whole point here is that what I'm seeing here with Tezos is absolutely beautiful. However, I think that <coughs> Ethereum is just going to be the number one. But Tezos is a very good, they have been working on it for a long time. A lot of smart people have been looking at Tezos and you can see that the momentum here is still like we hit all time high here on October 2021. Okay. After that, we kind of like have died down to $2 range. This is something that I haven't invested into and good. I didn't invest into it because it hasn't done basically anything. Uh, this is kind of like a project that it just doesn't run up. It, it can't, but it's still ranked 36. So it has a huge potential. I think that it has a huge potential. They're definitely in the right area. Proof of stake. Um, so you can see this, it just had to power the Web3 revolution. Um, so the secu it's secure, decentralized and uh, scalable. So, you know, this is built to remain a state of art. State of the art, it modules, architecture, and formal upgrade mechanism minimize disruptions while offering regular upgradability and enhanced function over time. So they have their own smart contract language. Um, yeah, so this is something that is very interesting to me, but I haven't invested into it because I just think um, I've been more of a Ethereum guy and I just Ethereum has been crushing it. They use like the people, everybody is on the Ethereum, like everybody is, uh, is on Ethereum blockchain. Like literally, like it's the, when people say that I, they're using blockchain, they are on Ethereum. Some of them may be on like a Solana and stuff like that, but the majority of it, it's all happening on Ethereum. So that's why I'm, I'd rather just invest in the Ethereum because if you if you have been studying Vitalik and the team, they are just crushing it. They are the best ones out there. They have the best team, the best product, the best solutions, you know? So like I told you uh, that with the Ethereum, the scalability has been the issue. I just told you how they're going to fix that so i believe in it within two years the term is going to be like 20k i don't know about tezos i don't know yeah i don't know if it's going to go the same lengths 
to be honest. I just don't. So that's why I have not invested in Tesla. Of course, in the next bull market, everything just go, is going to go up. So I think that this can easily go to like $10, uh, even up to $20. So it's like a 10x, sure. However, I have like much for myself, for my taste, I have better picks in my portfolio, in my opinion, like just way better. Okay. Um, like on like 10 X to hundred X to even thousand X peaks in my opinion. Anyway, so I'm not a financial advisor. If you want to see my portfolio, you can check out the first link in the description and this is not part of my portfolio. So I think that it's not worth buying, but if you want to diversify in different layer one solutions, and uh, this is a good candidate because they have their own smart contracts. They have their own, uh, it's a proof of stake. So it's not some kind of like a weird hybrid about proof of stake and proof of work. It's not a proof, proof of work. So proof of stake. Okay. Anyway. And uh, it's not delicated proof of stake, it's just pure proof of stake. Love it. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. See you in the next videos. See you in the portfolio. And peace out.